look at this balmy weather. It's just beautiful out. Okay, so I've been painting and I've been cleaning and I've been on mom duty. That's been my weekend. Hey guys, it's Katie Kate on the homestead. Just a little recap of the weekend as I have been trying to balance my mom duties with my homestead jobs. I was inspired to get back to work and finish up these little decorative corners that I was spray painting with the paint I bought the other day. I think it turned out really well. I love it a lot. The extra color really lights me up. Once I got that done, of course, my eye was drawn to my porch and I ended up doing the same treatment to some of my decorations in the front. Once I got painting, I got the bug and I decided to just use up the rest of the paint that I have purchased for this year. Since I've been here, every year I purchase a few cans of really bright paint that I can spread around the property while the weather is nice. As we're coming into the colder months, I figured I would just use up what I had left, so I finished all my cans of paint. Mom duties. I have a teenage son who is at that age where he has friends and a girlfriend, but he doesn't have a driver's license yet. So when they want to do things, I have to become the Uber. So I've been mom chauffeur. My kids' school is just over 20 minutes from where we live. So to drive him up there to where his friends live takes me about 45 minutes round trip. So I spent an hour and a half on the roads yesterday getting him where he wanted to be. And then this morning I was back up there again so they could all go to the mall and do some shopping. Fortunately, another mom is gonna drop him off so I don't have to go back up there to pick him up. Well, he just walked back in through the door, so everybody's home now. So I was saying with that extra time, I figured I would tackle the chicken coop because that's really on my to-do list. This area is not that dirty, but I wanna get rid of this trap, fill in the hole, and just kinda of consolidate. Here's the before. And this little guy's been doing okay. His feathers are coming back in. I'm hoping it is just a molt. I'm getting all my traps reset, so I'll show you that when it's done. This is much better, and I haven't seen any activity around that trap for at least a week, so hopefully things will quiet down. This will certainly allow me to see if there are any new disturbances. I pushed some of the cornmeal and baking soda down into the hole before I closed it up. Next section. I'm doing this a little bit at a time. I'm getting there. This is diatomaceous earth, which is supposed to help with fleas and other soft shelled parasites. I sprinkled the nesting boxes as well. I also leave them a little bin of diatomaceous earth to bathe in. Pine shavings for moisture and odor. I've got two traps baited in this box. This is my little trap box. And I've got two traps set under here. That's my second little trap area behind that board. Okay, well, there's lots of grain, clean water, Everything is clean. Today I was grateful for the fact that I tore down half of this mini enclosure because last year this whole thing was closed in and it was a nightmare to clean. Uh, it's a lot easier now. Okay, so this is reset. 
I know I only cleaned this a few months ago and considering how much time they spend outside, I'm really thinking that this winter, this coop is going to get filthy. So I'll just try to have hope for a nice mild day in January when I can get out and clean it out again. Painted outbuildings make me so happy. Last winter when they were cooped up, pardon the pun, I only had three hens and one rooster. So now I have 10 birds plus the two pigeons. So I anticipate the coop is going to get a lot dirtier this winter and I really wanted to give it another good cleaning and sanitation as soon as possible. Okay, so I've been painting, and I've been cleaning, and I've been on mom duty. That's been my weekend. Just a little update from the homestead. Look at this balmy weather. It's just beautiful out. Tomorrow's a brand new week, so until then, happy healthy living. I hope you're all doing well, staying safe, enjoying the fall. I am Katie Kate, staying busy on the homestead, and I'll see you later.